Hey guys, Jeannie here with a new LP recording, yay! Um, but anyways, this is a Nintendo 64 game, as you can tell. Um, look at the graphics. <laughs> the Nintendo 64 graphics, listen to the music, it's so 90s, I love it. Um, but anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get started on our LP. Snowboard Kids 2! Yay! Snowboard Kids 2! Um, anyways, yes, there is a regular Snowboard Kids 1, um, but I'll be doing an LP of this one, because it's, it's a lot better. Anyways, this is, this is a Nintendo 64 game, um, released in 1999, as you can see at the bottom. A uh, very big part of my childhood, guys. Very big part of my childhood. I love it. Love this game. I'm like, the, the character's very vibrant and colorful. Um, but anyways, they give us to start off with three options. Start, training, options. Let's go ahead and start the training. Um, it immediately takes you here. Um, we'll be playing a slash. Start and jump. Chase coach. Jump by pressing the A button to move forward. I'm assuming coach is this little penguin guy. Um, but anyways, let's go ahead and go press A to jump. Just like any other really little video game. Okay. Cornering. Tilt the control stick to the left and right to turn. Alright. Easy enough. Just turning. Turning. Following the little penguin. The cute little penguin. Coin. A coin is worth 100 G grand ghosts. Uh, gagas. <laughs> Enter a shop with a 100 G to buy weapons and items. Okay. How do the shops look like? Anyways. Weapons. Enter the red shop to buy weapons. Press the Z button to shoot. Okay, so these little present looking things, those are the shops you can enter. And you can do, um, uh, or I'm sorry, you can enter them and you can buy weapons in this specific color. Special technique. Hold down the control stick when using your bomb to shoot behind you. Sweet! Alright, so we got a hand. Enter the blue shell to buy items. Press the B button to use uh, these items. <laughs> Simple enough. Okay. So we got uh, some... It looks like a rocket. So let's go ahead and use our rocket. Quarant number two. To make sharp turns, hold down the control stick to the bottom left and right. And cornering will be very useful in upcoming um, uh, courses where the turns end up being extremely sharp and you'll have to do a lot of cornering. So we're gonna hit this penguin! Hit the penguin! Yay! We hit the penguin and he tripped. So that's how you use your items. You press Z. Uh, grab trick. Press any C button while in the air to do this trick. Tap other C buttons to do multiple grabs. So basically what it's saying is if when you do uh, a jump off the cliff or a jump ledge, whatever, press the Z buttons and like I said, this is a Nintendo 64 game. Um, so just press one of the yellow buttons on your control pad and you will do multiple tricks. Do grab tricks to earn some money and they're the easiest tricks you can do in the game. So see how he's just touching it? Spinning trick. Press and hold down the A button. Then hold down the control stick. Release the A button. You'll fall if you try to land while spinning. You do spinning tricks to earn more money. So basically, when you come up to the ledge, you hold down the A button. When you complete your, I guess, when you fly off the ledge, you're going to hold down your um, control stick in any direction you want. It could be left, right, down, up, forward, in a diagonal angle. And you let go of the A button and you'll perform a trick. So let's, I'll, I'll demonstrate that right now. Hold down the A button. Hold down back, and I did a backflip. Combination tricks. Press the C button while doing spinning tricks to perform combo tricks. You'll earn more money. So we're going to hold our A button down. We're going to do a backflip and then grab our board. See how I grabbed my board twice there? Um, and I just press the yellow buttons again, the C buttons. Continue the spinning trick. Press the A button and hold down the control stick. Release the A button, then tap the A button repeatedly. 
the same ways. You're going to do the same thing as a single trick to, uh, with your spinning tricks. Just when you release the A button, you're going to, after you release it, you're going to press the A button several, several times. So let's see how that looks like. You will spin as many times as you tap the A button. Earn more money by spinning more. Okay, little dude, whoever's talking to me, I guess it's a dead guy in the sky or something. You can change the direction of the spin if you hold down the control stick in different positions. Uh, they, had, <laughs> they had to say positions. You dirty, dirty game teaching kids dirty positions. Anyways, let's hold down. Sorry guys, I had to take off my headphones for a little bit. My, my dog's making snorry sounds and it's kind of creeping me out. I thought there was like someone robbing my house. <laughs> Anyways, let's continue on the game. I was like, holy shit, what the hell's... What's, who's talking to me? But it's my dog making uh, snoring sounds right next to me. Warning sign. When a rival shot... Uh, approaches you, you'll see an exclamation sign on the screen. When the exclamation mark blinks, jump! If the timing is right, you can dodge the attack by jumping! Yay! Jumping! Anyways, uh, maybe that little penguin guy will uh, throw something at us and I can demonstrate how that works. Lift. Approach the lift when you complete a lap. The lift for this course is located on the left hand side. So Liz basically just takes you to the top of the course again, and you'll start the race all over. Or not the race, but a second lap. Um, Liz can be in the center of uh, the uh, area, or the left, or the right, and it changes according to the um, the course you're in. My dog is now growling right next to me. I guess he's having an interesting dream. Anyways, let's continue. Acceleration technique. When you hit the wall and slow down, hold the stick upward and jump to accelerate faster. So anyways, what it's saying is, um, say you got hit by a weapon when you're getting near the lift area by another opponent. If you fall and trip or something, you need to get yourself back up. You just press the A button repeatedly um, and hold your control stick in the direction you want to go. Uh, don't hold the A button down because you will perform a trick and I'll let you know here. But if you jump too high, a trick will be executed, so be careful. Also, you can't go beyond the max speed, even with the control stick held up. Nice to know. Bravo! <laughs> the little penguin guy sounds so funny. These characters do sound funny. Um, but anyways, yeah, that's the end of the training lesson with Coach, and you will just have to beat him. Um, This training session is now over for the second lap. Remember what you've learned and snowboard! Okay, so we're kids, we're snowboarding, we have no lives, we don't go to school. Let's just snowboard. Um, and I'll be discussing the different items and weapons you can get in the game, and um, every character has their uh, different stats um, in the game. And I'll be going over those uh, when we get to the collector, uh, the character uh, selection screen. Anyways, how is everyone doing? I'm doing fine. Amazing. I actually recently got a new job. Um, yesterday uh, was my last day of my previous job, and next week I start my new job. So I have a whole week to goof around and do some recordings on catching up on my schoolwork. I have finals on Wednesday, so I find out my new job Tuesday. Um, I'm going to go on vacation next month to see my family. Um, I finished my projects for my school. I just need to do uh, one more homework assignment for my math class. Um, I'm just taking calculus right now and C++ computer programming. And I'll be taking calculus 2 next semester. And the second part of C++. It's going to be freaking sweet. Um, but how are you guys doing? Um, love to hear from you guys. Um, like I said, this is a new LP I'll be starting. It's a very short game. Um, this LP went, uh, won't take too long. Um, but yay! We beat the little penguin guy! Anyways, I'll see y'all in the next video. Um, thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and comment. And this has been Gina. Bye!